welcome everyone. There are hundreds of girls from all across the United States and across the world. Girls from more than 10 different countries who are joining us this weekend for Mother's Day. So it was a few years ago here in Boston, Massachusetts that I started Empower Her. And the idea was just really simple, really pure. We would go away on Mother's Day and we would pack our bags and get into a hotel and we would do yoga together and we would swim in the pool and do hair and makeup and we would do these events so that we could just gather in a big group and look around the room and realize you're not alone in your grief. And that was just something I so desperately wanted and Empower Her has done a really fantastic job um, for now five years doing that where girls can drive to our event and we can be together. Because the world is different right now, we decided at Empower Her that we still wanted to host this event, that it just meant too much and canceling it was just not an option and we didn't want to postpone it. and. So we just quickly turned into, you know, tech experts as best we really could so that we could just still create community for you girls, girls all around the world who are grieving the loss of their mother, who might think that a weekend like this is really hard. I always knew that that I wanted to be happy and that I wanted to have a happy life. And more than anything, I knew that what my mom would want for me and what all of our moms want for us. We need to practice self-love, compassion, and joy. My grief is my grief and your grief is your grief and you handle it however you want and what makes you comfortable. Know that during these hard times, you have a lot of people who care and love you. And for the great time and the strength that you have, um, and the strength that you have to be amazing and to know that you are not alone at all. This is a song that I wrote, um, inspired by the things that my mother and my aunt told me my whole life, which is to stand up for myself and to let my voice be heard. I know that this weekend is really hard for you girls. You know, I'm lucky enough to have a great mom, but I do know that this weekend is really hard for all of you girls. You girls are still able to connect with each other and support each other through this very tough weekend. Yeah, and we hope you can still have a great time together, even if it's virtually. And from me and Kalani, we just wanted to send you our love. No matter how victimized I feel in certain situations, I can always revert back to, you. as long as my heart is open, everything will be okay. And my heart is with all of you during this time, uh, not just this weekend, but above and beyond. And time really helps. So in time, you'll be able to think about your wonderful mothers and be able to laugh and have good memories. But I know that right now, it's very, very difficult. I like to believe my mom is looking down on me and really proud of me, and I'm sure yours is too. So stay strong, you're gonna be okay. okay. You are love, you are a light being, and I just hope that this is a reflection of that for you. Through the amazing mission of Empower Her, we get to remember that we are never alone. No matter where you are, we're here and we do have community. We might not be physically together, but we're not separated.